Hey y'all, Tammy with Vintage Uprise in Texas here. We're gonna do a different video. Uh, lots of people have been asking me about the uh, the game that we play at Christmas time, the Saran Wrap Ball. And I decided I'm gonna videotape my Saran Wrap Ball game for y'all to see. It's, it's lots of fun. You put on mittens, roll dice. Um, I guess I probably need to link some directions in here too. So, I'm going to show you how to do it. And this is the ball that we were making. So, check it out. It's fun for you, for you and the whole family. <laughs> Christmas. It's a fun game getting everybody involved, all ages. I usually do this for my adult kids <laughs> and all you need is clear tape, saran wrap, and your gift items. That's all it takes. I'm going to show you what all I put in it and you can put anything in it, preferably kind of flat. But if it's a little thickness, it still works. You can make it happen. Um, but I'm going to show you everything I put in my ball. So I'm going to do this video, and I'm going to speed it up while I'm wrapping, because that could take a little bit of time. And I will show you the end of this product. So let's get to it. It's going to take a little while, and your arms might get tired, maybe even your back. But let me show you what I do. So here are the items that I chose for this game ball. And as you can see, I have liquor bottles and they're not flat, but we'll make it work. And look, these are even bigger. Some wine bottles, miniature wine bottles. I have some little note cards. Um, car, what is this? A car, little smelly thing for your car. Some koozies and some beef jerkies now i got the short ones but you can put the long ones in there too because they bend and then we have candy an eye mask we have a blankie yes a blankie and then these fun little coaster things anything goes that will lay flat well i say that because this ain't flat this isn't flat little head scratcher and then we got some treats, some more koozies, more candy, socks for the girls, and socks for the guys. And I even have a t-shirt. So all these items I'm going to break up and wrap them in cellophane. And I'll show you as we go how we do this. Um... I usually get lottery tickets too, and I forgot those, but lottery, I mean, scratch off tickets. So, scratch offs would be really good in here too. Sometimes they might get torn with them ripping through the packages, but you know, they can kind of see what they're fixing to grab in the process. So, let me show you how I fit all of this into a saran wrap ball. Okay, I laid all my stuff out on the floor. You need room to do this. Um, I opened up my packages, my candy. Oh, I need to open this blanket. Um, and my socks. I separated the socks that I pulled out for it. And, and I need to open these. This is coal. I mean, open one row and all you get is coal. <laughs> that will be good. So, now this can get expensive. It can. Um, and I didn't get around to getting my uh, scratch-offs. Forgot about those on the way home. But what I have here, what little I do have here, 
that I showed you in the video was already $70, just over $70. Now, I'm going to take this blanket, and since I usually take my biggest item, and it's soft and plushy, and roll it into a ball as much as I can, no biggie, it'll squash around, and this is going to be my centerpiece. This is what I'm going to make. This is the last gift that will be won. And uh, let's get this out of the way. And I'm going to take my saran wrap and wrap it. Bottle out of the way. And I've had this saran wrap for several parties. Um, it's lasted me a while, but it's one of those big ones. But you wrap it just like you're wrapping some of your packaging for shipping. <laughs> and so the game doesn't go quick. You tape it. Tape it up. Because once they find an opening for the saran wrap, it's going to open up really quick. So, yeah, tape it up. When you wrap something, sometimes I wrap them twice to make it harder to get. But you wrap one way, and then you turn the item and wrap the other way. Okay? So. I don't know if I did that right or not. But I'm going to wrap it one more time. We're going to make the last one hardest to get out, I hope. So I don't know exactly how many saran wrap this would take for one person to do. And it all really depends on on uh, how many items you have. Tape the edges down. There you go. There's my first row. And now to add something. We're going to add a pair of Batman socks. And in each row, you add a new item. I'm going to do a little taping in between my wrapping. We have to make the put the tape on to make the game last longer. And there you go. Okay, so I'm going to keep doing this and. When I get to something that's a little bulky and harder to fill, like especially this long item, I'll show you when I get there. But I'm going to be speeding up this video because <laughs> this will take a while. Be sure to tape down those edges 
Don't make it easy. I'm not even sure I put something in that wrap, in that round. <laughs> Now, hint to putting something long and big in. You take it and you put it with the length of your ball that it's going. Like this is a little shorter and it sticks out a little bit more. So I'm going to try to put it with the length of it. And then I'll counter the weight on the other side when I roll the next item. So we'll do it something like that. Look at these cuties. They are um, shot glass coasters or, or koozies. You know, the miniature koozies. <laughs> For your shot glass. See that Lumbaco? I'm going to make that one really easy. And by that, I mean, I'm not going to put tape on it. A little hint to help them keep from poking into here and ripping it. You put tape to help them keep from poking the toe in it. So this takes a while. You may have to get up and stretch your legs. I went and got me some eggnog and this is a good time to catch up on your YouTube videos. Right now I'm watching the Old Curiosity Shop. Okay, here it is. Here's my big old ball with just about everything in it. Now, I ended up not putting this in it because it was just, it wasn't working. It would stick out too much and it just wasn't working. So, we'll do that for something else. You see Brucey laying there? <laughs> so, here it is. And I'm going to do a clip of the video of... Uh, of the kids opening it here at the end. Let y'all see how it works. Okay, so the rules to this game is get everybody sitting in a circle on the floor or around a table with nothing else in the way. Uh, one person will start with the ball in front of them, have mittens, and we usually have a Santa hat or an elf hat or something that they have to put on. And the person immediate to the left will have a pair of dice. And you yell go. And the person with the mittens and the hat will have to start trying to unravel this ball. And in the process, the person to the left is rolling and trying to get a double with their dice. Uh, as soon as they roll a double, they yell double and they steal the mittens and the ball and the hat 
from the person, and this is fast paced, nothing slow about this, because the person to their left is grabbing the dice and starting to roll a double two, trying to get a double. And they may not even get anything out of this ball before that next person rolls their double. So anything that falls out while the person that is unraveling it gets the prizes that fall out. And then it moves on. And you keep going all the way around the circle until the last gift is um, out. Now, um, depending on how fast you can make this game go, or how slow, or you know how long it will take, it's on how you wrap it. That's why I say use the tape. Because if you just use a saran wrap, it might go kind of quick. But if you put some tape on it, and believe me, they'll get through it. That's the reason for the Bentons, to help prolong it as well. So, and I see a little spot already that I could probably tape down because it looks like it's too easily lifted. And that's how we do the game ball. Uh, no, it goes another way. No way, we're doing it. This no, way. no, no. The person in the rolling has to be in front of you. Row, row. Not backwards. Doubles. Uh, <laughs> grab them. That's I right. Uh, <laughs> it's hot. Do I need new dice? That was. Oh, oh my God. Hell? Shake them up. Yeah, I get the hat. There we go. Oh, Better hurry. Oh. Next. Oh, Here, guys. You're up next. Boy, y'all better get it going because it's going to take forever to get these done. Bro, keep rolling. It's harder than it ends. Keep rolling. Keep rolling. Roll fast. Roll fast. Hey, y'all don't tell nobody roll fast. What? Yes. I skipped my turn. Go, go, go. Grab the mittens. Grab the mittens. Grab the hat. Loads of fun for everyone.